Hey everyone, what's going on? Scout Flip and Customize, and today we have a product review and or test and or trying it out. However you want to call it, it's a high bay LED light. It's 150 watts. It's made by our friends over at Lumery. I hope I pronounced that right. And it runs from warm to cool white. Now this is a high bay light that is a smart high bay light. As you know, if you follow the channel along, we went ahead and installed high bay lights that we got off of Amazon. I believe we have seven in here total. Um, and it is awesome in here at night. It's super bright. I get compliments all the time. However, I've been considering adding one more, one row back from the back wall to cover the bench and the toolbox area. Because occasionally when you're over here working, see my hand, you get a shadow right there. So today, I'm going to run a little bit of conduit and another outlet. And we're going to go ahead and get this thing plumbed up and wired up and test it out. Well, fun part, right? Let's, let's get into the box, see what we got. Again, this is uh, Lumery. High Bay LED Smart LED Light. So when I say smart, I'm thinking it probably comes with a remote control, which probably means it's smarter than me because, well, we'll see. We'll see. Um, but as far as, I think 150, I wanna say, if I remember right, these are all 150 watts as well. Um, I did cool white on mine. The outlet, everything looks very similar for hookup, which is super cool. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and unbox this thing and show you what we got. And I already found a remote control. So how cool is that? Oh, wow. Check it out. You pair it to your phone. You got 35, 50K, 50%, 10, 100%. You can change the light tone, everything. That is pretty freaking rad. That's probably a sensor. Um, let's see. Let's get out of the box. All right. Basically, we've got our hook on the back. It just threads in. We got our sensor plug on the, the middle here. Which I think, honestly, if you just had it on a switch, which ours is going to be on a switch, so I'm hoping we can just turn it on and off with a switch. But we may have to use the remote, so we'll get to that. And you don't need to see me running conduit in another outlet because, well, that'd be a whole nother video. So I'm going to get that part done and get to where we're hanging this thing up. And I do use a chain and a nut cert to the beam and then another lanyard on there for safety. All right, we got it hanging. I've got the new outlet installed and the wiring run all the way up to this light that we're going to come off from there. I'm um, actually going to tie that in tomorrow when we have some better daylight, just because I have to obviously shut these lights off to tie them in. It's me black in here. So, finish it up in the morning. All right, everyone, we got our Lumery light all hooked up. We got our remote figured out. We got the app installed. So, it's the Lumery app. You go ahead and click on it. It opens up and you can literally control the light from your phone. So, if I shut it off right here, Boom, it's off. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit the on button. Boom, it's on. I can change the color tone. Boo. Like that, isn't that crazy? Technology. And then also on the remote, once you pair it with the remote, you can go ahead and put like, oh, I want 10% light. Nope, I want 100%. Boom. So the remote works as well. Oh, you know what, I want it off. We don't need it. I'm not working on the uh, a bench over there, so I don't need it. And so we have all our other lighting, but we're over here and that's what's cool about it. It's like, you know what? We need some extra light. Boom. There we go. So it's working actually really, really well. Um, so that'll come on or off and you can use the remote and the main switch to the building can turn them on or off as well. So that right there is pretty freaking cool and it works actually quite well. So there you have it guys. This is our Lumery LED high bay light install that we installed in the shop as an additional light so something that we can control with a remote and or our phone using the app and i'm not a huge technology guy so it took me a minute to figure it out um, as far as getting the app goes but i couldn't get the remote to work you do have to download the app so you download the app it, i guess it tells the light oh you're okay to work the light would work it would come on but i couldn't do anything with the remote once I installed the app and it was actually really easy, it discovered it right away, I was able to control it with the remote. So now even when I go over there and shut it off on the building, I can go ahead, turn the building back on and control the light again. So it's pretty easy once you've got it hooked up. It's not a bad install at all. Again, if you're already wired, I had to wire it, it took me a little longer, but all in all, it's a good light. Uh, time will tell how, how well and how long this thing works, um, but that's the light itself. So as you can see, uh, it's something they sent us. We wanted to give it a shot and we're happy with it overall. So thanks again, Lumery. And I'm going to go ahead and drop the link to the uh, light and where you can get this 
on Amazon right in the description of this video. So go ahead and click on that link. It's going to be an associate link. It'll take you right to this light. So you can go ahead and order one up yourself and give it a shot. And it's pretty cool because you can match the tones to your building itself. So thanks for watching. Scott Flip and Customized.